We have a lot of lingo in the cloth diaper community. All-in-ones, pocket diapers, rye snaps, double gussets. It's a lot. Today, I'm going to explain what the heck a double gusset is, what it does, how to know if you should use one, and I'll also give you a few recommendations. So let's go. So what exactly is a double gusset? Well, a double gusset is simply a second set of elastics in the leg area. And these can be two types, internal gussets and external gussets. Now, let's take it one by one. Internal gussets, now these are the OG double gussets. These are the ones that were developed way back in 2006 uh, by Kank Care when it was actually just a girl named Julie in her home. She invented and perfected and patented the internal double gusset. And when I was researching double gussets, um, wanting to go to the source, I did interview Julie. Um, and I, you know, that's in the whole double gusset article that I put together. And you can find that article in the description. I'll drop the link. So if you want to know more information about double gussets and how they were invented and so on, that article will be down there. Or you can just go to the website and Google double gussets and in the little search bar at the top and that's what will come up. Anyhow. So the OG double gussets are the internal gussets. Now, what internal gussets are, excuse me, is they're sewn into the lining. Um, so that means they have to be in a diaper, like a pocket diaper, because there needs to be a lining. It's sewn right into the inner lining. This is different than external double, double gussets that are sewn into the PUL of the diaper. So you'll find them most often in cloth diaper covers. So that's when you'll see the double gusset like this. So in the PUL, not in the lining. So just to give you a comparison, internal, external. So what the heck do internal gussets do? Well, since Julie at Kanka Care invented them, I asked her and she told me, and I'll read it, so I'm not putting words in anybody's mouth. I'll read it out for you. Double gussets are your double barrier protection on the interior of the diaper against blowouts both out the legs and up the back. Kanka Care has an inner gusset elastic channel that runs along the inside of each leg to double your coverage as well as a bonus elastic just above the pocket opening at the back of the diaper, so the back below the back elastic, sorry, which offers a double gusset back elastic. She said with Kanka Care's double gusset diapers, you get a double you get a system that keeps the messiest messes where they belong in the diaper. So you can see what she was talking about here. There's one, two gussets, and then the inner double gusset that runs along both legs. This made complete sense to me because that's really what they do. So if you envision a baby's bum sitting right here, um, and maybe it's a newborn having one of those newborn explosive poops, the elastic is kind of cradling their bum and it kind of acts as a roadblock. So nothing will kind of get out, right? And it doesn't rely on that one set of elastics. So that makes sense to me. That's, that is what it does, really. Okay, but what about double external gussets? Well, and I dropped it. <laughs> so double gussets on the outside of the waterproof layer of the diaper and not on the inside actually have a completely different function. Yes, they also help prevent leaks, but they're there to prevent fit-related leaks meaning leaks caused by gaps between the leg elastic and baby's legs. So, which double gusset is better for you and your baby? If you're looking for leak protection, a double gusset diaper will definitely help you, but there are three things you need to know to make a clear choice between the two. And the first is style availability. So again, it's important to note that internal gussets are only possible in diapers with a soft lining. This is because, again, those internal gussets are sewn right into the inside lining of the diaper. So it's only really possible in things like pocket diapers and fitted diapers. If you're using a system like pre-fold and flat diapers, it just won't be an option for you because you can't get internal gussets in those types of diapers. You would instead need to go with an external uh, double gusset like on a cloth diaper cover. The second thing to really think about when choosing between the two is the type of protection that you need. So again, those internal gussets are really, they were created to help you with blowout protection. So to keep all the messes in, if you have, you know, a very mobile baby that's all over the place, if you have a newborn that's having some, some powerful things happen, it's all about blowout protection and that type of thing, mess 
containment. Whereas the external gussets, again, are just about, you know, having enough room to have all of those fitteds and flats and everything. You can really customize the absorption inside them, but still, you know, get a nice snug fit around that leg crease. Which brings me to point three, which is fit. So for babies with thinner legs especially, external leg gaskets can really help with fit as they will pull the diaper even closer to baby's legs and give you gap-free contact around the leg crease and that will help prevent leaks as we've discussed. If your baby has chumby, chubbier legs, and let me take a second to say, you know, chubby legs, twiggy legs, all babies are different, all babies change and grow throughout their infancy, one is not better than the other. But if your baby happens to have chubby legs at this moment and you're kind of debating between the two based on gusset type alone, internal or external, I personally would choose internal gussets. I say this because babies that have nice plump rolly thighs generally don't need help getting the diaper to fit in the leg crease. And in some cases, those external gussets can make some parents worry that maybe the diaper is too snug even when it's fine it just it gives them that impression so if you're debating between the two and your baby has chunky legs i would say go with the internal just because you'll have an easier time with it on the other hand if your baby has spindly legs you may really want to consider the external gussets as i said and maybe internal as well because again every baby would want to take advantage of this right and that is something that you can do so you can get you know a fitted diaper with internal gussets and put a diaper cover over it that has external gussets and then you get that double kind of leak protection you're protecting the blowouts and you're protecting from blowouts and everything but you're also getting that nice fit for your twiggy leg baby so that's an option are double gussets the way to go in general well without a doubt a double gusset whether internal or external is a de design choice that many parents have loved from day one, including myself. Um, Julie said that as soon as she started designing and advertising the double gusset, she was overwhelmed by the response and had to shut down her shop and, you know, get better production. I I'm not telling the story well. Again, if you want to know all about the history of double gussets and a lot more information and recommendations, hit that uh, link in the description below or check out the website and search double gussets. Um, and in that article, I also have links to um, the best double gusset diapers that I have found, which do feature a lot of Kanga Care diapers. I mean, it makes sense. They're the ones who invented it and perfected it and patented it and all that. So yeah, <laughs> there's lots of recommendations that I have um, in that link down below, but I will get into some in this video. I won't get into all of them in this video because I'm really trying to keep myself tight and short in this one. I'll give you my basic internal, external double gusset recommendations, the kind of the go-to ones. So for internal double gussets, it's going to be no surprise, I recommend the Rumperoos. And these are Kanka Care's pocket diapers. Now, what's my absolute, like, to die for favorite? It's going to be the Rumperoos OBV diaper. OBV stands for Organic Bamboo Velour. And that is what is on the inside of this guy. And it's so soft and luxurious and plush. I'm a touch person, so I just love it. Um, it's organic, so you don't have to worry about any um, synthetic fiber sensitivities. It's highly, highly absorbent. The velour is going to keep baby nice and dry. And with it, you get um, organic cotton and bamboo inserts. And these these are thick and they're they're hefty. I'm very optimistic about these. I think they're going to hold even overnight for um, a younger baby before toddlerhood, especially. Um, so I'm very optimistic about these. They're just they're just everything you could possibly want in a diaper, and it has that double gusset as well. So as far as double gusset diapers, these are these are the ones that I'm in love with right now. Um, but the one drawback is with all that you know organic bamboo loveliness absorption power, you are paying a little bit of a premium. So that's why I include you know the Rumperoo's regular diaper. So this is basically the same design same diaper you get the patented inner the patented inner double gussets but it's in the less expensive materials so you're getting the the you know um polyester chamois uh not chamois you know what i'm saying micro chamois um inside you know it's very very soft and lovely too but it is the synthetic it will keep baby dry um and on the inside it does come with 
really good thick ones, but they are a microfiber. Now, if you purchase these on the Kanka Care website, and I'll drop a link to their website down below as well, um, and all the products that I recommend in this video will be in the description below as well. Um, if you go out and order on their website, you can upgrade the inserts to a natural fiber insert. I really recommend doing that because if you upgrade the insert, these are going to be perfect. They're, they're going to be great. You're going to have all that absorbency, but you know, you are going to save a little bit of money because you're not getting that bamboo interior of the, the floor. So that is my recommendation, my top recommendation for internal double gussets. I should say that if you have a newborn, you know, unless you are expecting a very, very large baby, if you wanted a cloth diaper from day one, you're going to need to consider newborn diapers. And Kanga Care happens to be the maker of the little Joey cloth diaper. So this is an all-in-one, um, excuse me, an all-in-one diaper for newborns. It has the umbilical cord snap. It is all-in-one, meaning you don't have to insert it, do anything else like that. It is this synthetic. It's got the, the chamois inside. Um, and it has the double gussets. If you've ever had newborn poops to deal with, you know that blowouts are intense in the newborn stage. So these double gussets are going to be wonderful. And you know, little little Joey's have been the kind of like the standby newborn diaper recommendation ever since I started cloth diapering in 2015. And you know, writing these articles and thinking about it, I really think it's because of that internal double gusset now that just it clicks, it makes sense in my head that that's why these ones have been the top recommendation for so long. So anyhow, if you're looking for an internal double gusset on newborn diapers, Little Joys for sure. Okay, so what happens if you're looking for external gussets? Where should you look? Well, you have a little bit of choice now. If you're looking for something, you know, with a lining, something that, you know, you put together and it's very easy at the change table, that kind of system. I would recommend Wink has an organic bamboo all-in-one diaper. I've reviewed them before. They're, you know, a really nice option. They're very inexpensive, um, just a good organic option. They come with seven layers of organic terry inside of them. It is an all-in-one, so it has like a flap that folds in. I don't have one with me today because I gave it to my um, reviewing mom to review, so I end up giving all of my diapers away, um, but I will put a link. It's um, organic bamboo terry so that is very different from the organic bamboo velour so I just want to make that clear um, bamboo terry will look like this so this is what the inside of the wink diaper will be just a terry it's it's soft enough but it's not the it's not the bamboo organic velour right <laughs> but um, that's what you'll get in that one now if you're doing up a diaper system like pre-folds or flats it is then you want a cloth diaper cover and Rumparoos this one it would not be my recommendation but Rumparoos also has one um, I, I don't have one here with me again sorry but that has the the external gussets and is a really great brand their pee well is nice and like thick yet soft and pliable it's just a great cloth diaper cover it is um, wipeable um, in the middle, so when you take your pre-fold out, if it's not soiled, you can wipe it down and reuse it again and again. I should note also that the, the diaper covers with the external gussets um, in the Rumparoos also come in newborn size, and they also have, in both newborn size and the one size, a fitted diaper with their internal gussets. So they have fitted diapers that are OBV, so the organic bamboo velour, so, oh, so nice, <laughs> in a fitted diaper, like, um, so, and they have the internal gusset. So if you wanted to do both, you can. It's going to be a little, you know, less cost effective, but if you're looking for you like super nothing, you know, bulletproof solution because they're organic um, bamboo, they're fluffy, they have the internal gussets, you would have the external gussets with the cover. Nothing's getting out of those. They will cost you a little bit more. They're definitely like the premium. So maybe you don't want to build your whole stash out of that. Maybe that'd be a great option for nighttime, especially. That would be mint. Um, so yeah, that that is an option if you have the budget for it. So that's double gussets. That's the difference between external and internal, when you might use them, when you might want either or. A, little, a few options. If you want more options and more recommendations and, you know, more, more information, again, that link in the description. I will have a review, a full review of how 
both um, Rumperoos diapers perform coming out very soon. If you want that, hit subscribe because I will not only make an article out of that, but I will also make another video. So if you hit subscribe, you will get notified about that. I have a lot in the works. It's just finding time to get all this stuff done, but you will get them as soon as they are available and you will get notified if you click subscribe and hit the little bell. And if you want to do me a solid, you could also hit the thumbs up button. That would be amazing. But that's it for now. That's it for today. I will see you in the next one. Until then, bye. Thanks.